Good evening. Welcome to Bristol Community College Student Awards Ceremony. My name is Kathleen Burns, and I'm the Director of Student Life, and I serve as the Chairperson of the College Awards Committee. It is truly an honor to welcome you all here. This evening, we are here to recognize students who have demonstrated exceptional academic growth, development, and for those who have made significant contributions in service and leadership at Bristol Community College. At this time, I would like to introduce some of the college trustees that are in the audience. Cynthia Rose, Sandra Saunders, want to stand up? You do, I know you do. <laughs> Cynthia Rose, Sandra Saunders, Diane Sylvia, and our student trustee, Samuel Lima. I would also like to ask the members of the President's and Vice President's Councils to please stand up to be recognized. Now let me introduce my distinguished colleagues and presenters for this evening's event. To my right, Dr. John J. Sprager, President of Bristol Community College. Ms. Carol A. Michael, class of 1970, and chair of the Bristol Community College's Alumni Association. Next is Ms. Susan McCourt, Associate Professor of Mathematics and Director of the Commonwealth Honors Program. Next is Ms. Elizabeth McCarthy, Vice President of Resource Development. Dr. Greg Thesaurus, Vice President for Academic Affairs. And Mr. Stephen Ozug, Vice President of Compliance, Campus Preparedness, and Students. To my left, Dr. Kathleen Pearl, Dean of Behavioral and Social Sciences. Mr. William Barati, Dean of Business and Information Management. Ms. Patricia Dent, Dean of Health Sciences. Dr. Samad Saman, Dean of Mathematics, Science, and Engineering. Ms. Sarah Morrow, Dean of Access and Transition. And lastly, Dr. Suzanne Buglioni, Dean of the Lash Division of Teaching and Learning. At this time, I would like to acknowledge and thank the members of the BCC College Awards Committee for their tremendous work and support throughout the year. They, they are the people that have been telling you what to do all night, hanging around here, making this night run smoothly. So, Gloria Cabral, <laughs> Je Jenna DiBatoli, Katie LaFave, I know she's a favorite of you guys, but she isn't here this evening, but she's done a lot of work. Rhonda Magnuski, <laughs> Diane Manson, Nancy Moxon, Vanak Penn, Nancy Santo Padre, Derek Favaris, and Patricia Weisberger. Many thanks to the faculty, staff, and students who have submitted the nominations and to our student ambassadors for handing out the programs and checking in our guests. There are numerous faculty and administrators and staff in the audience this evening. I would also like to thank all of you for your dedication and support to Bristol Community College and our students. And now, it is my pleasure to introduce the president of Bristol Community College, Dr. John J. Sprager. Thank you and good evening. This is a wonderful night, uh, one of the favorite ones of the year as we celebrate excellence. And I congratulate all of the award winners uh, for the demonstrated excellence that they have put forward while at Bristol Community College. Um, you know, something I always mention on the, at this night is uh, uh, the terrible effects that envy has in our society. Envy. Uh, leads people to tear down standards who can't live up to those standards. And you have demonstrated the way to live up to those standards and exceed them. 
Uh, so we have to be, it's a pernicious influence in our society. And uh, I hope that uh, your, de your role modeling, your demonstration, your excellence will help combat that uh, evil uh, influence that we suffer. This is a bittersweet moment for me because this is my last awards night. Uh, after leave, uh, I'll be leaving this year after 17 years. And the only reason I mention it, I haven't been talking too much about it, but uh, the music that was playing when you came in uh, was uh, actually written 17 years ago by my brother uh, for the uh, inauguration that, w that I had in those days, way back then. Uh, so it, uh, it's a, kind of an emotional time for me to hear that music and uh, think of all the wonderful years that have intervened between 2000 and uh, 2017. So I wish you well. I uh, hope that you will continue. I don't hope, I know you will continue your pathways of excellence in whatever endeavors you choose to pursue. And always know, as I tell everyone at graduation, you always have a home here. Any way we can be of any help, your esteemed members of our Bristol Community College family, and whatever it takes in this age of lifelong learning for us to help you, please don't hesitate and you'll always be welcome here. Thank you and congratulations. So thank you, Dr. Spraga. And now, Carol A. Michael, class of 1970 and chair of the Bristol Community College's Alumni Association, will come up and announce the Alumna of the Year. Welcome, graduates. This award is given to an alumnus or alumna who, through pro professional achievement, or personal dedication has demonstrated an outstanding commitment and accomplishment to their field or to the community. I am thrilled to welcome and introduce such a special graduate as this year's 2017 Alumna of the Year, Elaine Imond, Class of 1980. Good evening, President Spraga, members of the awards community, faculty, award winners, family, and friends. I am honored and humbled to be the recipient of the 2017 Alumna of the Year Award. And congratulations to, all, to all the other award winners here tonight. When I stood before a similar group of people 37 years ago as the valedictorian for the class of 1980, I never imagined that one day I would be standing here again as an award-winning speaker. As a graduate of the BCC Child Care Program, I had all the tools I needed to start my career, become successful in that career, and be able to give back to the community. No matter what your major, BCC has provided you with those same tools. As BCC graduates, the foundation that has been given to you has prepared you for whatever your next step is, whether it be to pursue higher education or entering the workforce. Take what you have learned here, follow your dreams, stay focused on your life's goals, and you can accomplish anything. I am living proof of that. I am so grateful to have started my college education here at BCC. Everything I gained here as a student, combined with perseverance and passion, enabled me to pursue and attain my life stream of owning my own daycare center. During my journey, I've been able to give back to our community by not only providing quality education and care to so many children, but also by providing employment to so many staff, many of whom are current BCC students or graduates, that recognize their value as caregivers, educators, and employees as well as providing current BCC student interns 
with hands-on experience and the benefits of my knowledge as they pursue careers in this field. To be the owner and director of a quality daycare center and to be able to have a hand in helping ensure that future generations of children have competent, caring teachers gives me an immeasurable sense of gratitude and fulfillment. As an avid volunteer to so many charitable organizations, it makes me so happy and proud to be able to give back to the community in so many ways. There is no better feeling in the world. And it all started here, as it has for you. We've been blessed to be graduates of the best community college in the area. And to be publicly recognized for all of our hard work brings pride to a whole new level. When you do good in this world, good comes back to you in unexpected and wonderful ways. All you have to do is apply what you've learned here, follow your heart, infuse your passions into your everyday lives, and I have no doubt that not only will you succeed in attaining your life streams as I have, but some of you will be standing at this podium in years to come, just as I am this evening. Thank you again. Susan McCourt, Associate Professor of Mathematics and Director of the Commonwealth Honors Program, will now present the Commonwealth Honors Program Awards. Ms. Diana Orocho will assist Ms. McCourt with the honor court. The Bristol Community College Commonwealth Honors Program offers over 250 outstanding students the opportunity to participate in honors classes, interdisciplinary honors seminars, and significant research projects and presentations. These students elect to enroll in classes that require them to go well above and beyond the college level rigor and be challenged by even more more reading and writing, more synthesis and analysis, more preparation and discussion. These students share the same challenges as many at Bristol Community College, balancing their studies with jobs, caring for family members, and actively participating in their communities. I am humbled by all that they accomplish. On Student Awards Night, the Commonwealth Honors Program recognizes the students in the program who have chosen to participate in even more scholarly endeavors. These students have completed at least three honors experiences and they have worked with a faculty member to successfully produce a significant interdisciplinary research project and present their findings in written and oral presentation, all done while maintaining a GPA of at least 3.45. Tonight we award these students with honors cords and recognize them as Commonwealth Honors Scholars. The Commonwealth Honors Program Scholars are Deanna G. Angel. Jillian Carmel. Solomon Carrero. Jessica Lee Costa. Kimberly A. Dos Santos. Amber Lynn Figueredo.
Nicole M. Florio. Anna Rose Flynn. <laughs> Kathleen L. Gonzi. <laughs> Brianna Elizabeth Harris. Sabrina Elizabeth Jefferson. <laughs> Troy Joseph Lima. <laughs> Hallie J. Monty. Annabelle Santiago. <laughs> Daniel Lewis Sultan. <laughs> Roxa Mean Soon. Abigail Lynn Swass. Declan Neil Tabor. Karen Regina Town. Samantha Whitney. This year's John J. Spraga PhD Honors Book Award is awarded to a Commonwealth Honors student who has served the Commonwealth Honors Program in, in, in addition to doing the scholarship, and it is Daniel Lewis Soltran. Congratulations to all the Commonwealth Honor Scholars. <laughs> Elizabeth McCarthy, Vice President for Resource Development, will present the Bristol Community College Foundation Scholarships. The Bristol Community College Foundation is pleased to present the All USA Academic Team Scholarship. It is co-sponsored by the Phi Theta Kappa International Honor Society and the American Association of Community Colleges. Nominees are chosen for their outstanding academic achievement as well as sig significant college and community service. We have two recipients this year. The first recipient is Samuel Kelanu Lima. The second recipient is Daniel John Rodriguez. The Bristol Community College Art and Design Award in Animation and Mo Motion Graphics is awarded to Kayla Branson. Bristol Community College Art and Design Award in Fine Arts is awarded to Mel Melanie Poria. 
the Bristol Community College Art and Design Award in Foundation. We have two recipients. First recipient is Amanda Aruda. The second recipient is Albina Matthews. The Bristol Community College Art and Design Award in Graphic Design is awarded to Roxa Soon. The Bristol Community College Art and Design Award in Web Design is presented to Joseph Travis. The Bristol Community College Foundation Quest Scholarship. Two recipients. The first one is Kylie Monis. The second recipient is Siv Takor. The Helen Marie Booth Theater Award is presented to Leandra King. The recipient of the Kenneth M. Candeus Memorial Scholarship is Justine Jasmine Brown. <laughs> CIS Game Development Award is presented to Sean Duffy. CIS Networking Award is presented to Timothy Oldford. CIS Programming Award is presented to Craig Dumont. The CIS Transfer Award is presented to Andrew Graham Briggs. The second recipient is Jillian Ames Massey. The CIS Computer Web Development Award is presented to Michaela S. Logan. The recipients of the CRC Book Award for Outstanding Scholastic Achievement and Excellence in Chemistry 090 are Erin Contois and Deborah Gilbert. The recipient of the CRC Book Award for Outstanding Scholastic Achievement and Excellence in Chemistry 113 is Jeffrey Pyers. The recipient of the CRC Book Award for Outstanding Scholastic Achievement and Excellence in Chemistry 114 is Anna Rose Flynn. The Captain James D. Crossan Scholarship is awarded to Candice Ginta. The Charles E. Croshaw Memorial Scholarship is awarded to Brianna Rassicott. The recipients of the Jeanette Denning Writing Awards, first place, Colleen Mishner. Second place is Julia Macumber. And third place is Sheldon Santos. The recipient of the Johanna DuPont Occupational Therapy Assistance Scholarship is Stacy Nunes. The recipient of the Dr. Cynthia K. Carr Scholarship is Anna Brasero. <clears throat> the recipient of the Raymond J. LaVirtue Senior Scholarship is Kyle Gomes. The recipient of the Ron Lister Professor Emeritus Design Award is Solomon Carrero. The 
recipient of the Ron Lister Professor Emeritus Fine Art Award is Mark Benito Allen. The recipient of the Katia Lund International Student Award is Siv Kumar Thakur. The Basil and Teresa Maraveras Memorial Scholarship is awarded to Annabella Santiago. The Charles Markovich Memorial Scholarship recipients are Valerie Mariah Romero. The Barry McKee Scholarship is awarded to Harley Farrell. The Outstanding Astronomy Student in Astronomy um, AST 111 is William Oliveira. The Jessica M. Raposa 05 Memorial Scholarship is awarded to Sonia Priest. The Jesse E. Richardson Art Award is given to an art program student who has excelled in painting. The recipient is Chad Steven Lubertowitz. The recipient of the Jennifer E. Serper Memorial Scholarship is Jennifer Rose Perry. John Stobart Awards, first plate, Mark Benito Allen. Second place is Andre Valaziev. And third place is Kate Carrero. The Edward Terrell Smith Memorial Scholarship is awarded to Samuel Kalamu Lima. <laughs> Student Mathlete Competition, Fall Semester, Round One, First Place, Nicholas Blair Rogers. Second place, Samuel Kelmulima. <laughs> and third place is Finn Burback. Spring semester round two, first place, Nicholas Blair Rogers. Second place is Adam. Oh, pause. Okay. Take two, Nicholas Blair Rogers. Second place, Adam Franker. In third place, Samuel Kalamulima. The Student Math Lead Award, Stephen Darrell Hall. The Professor Marion Wilner Art Book Award is presented to an outstanding art transfer student who has demonstrated creativity and excellence in drawing and design. The recipient is Matthew Robert Seaman. Congratulations to all of the award recipients. I would now like to introduce Patricia Dent, Dean of Health Sciences, to present the curriculum awards for Division I. The curriculum award is given to graduating students who are recognized for the characteristics of reliability, perseverance, and high academic quality. This award expresses the college's confidence in the recipient 
as he or she enters the world of business, community service, or higher education. I am pleased to announce that this year, the College Awards Committee has divided the curriculum award into two different awards, one for high academic achievement and one for perseverance and growth. The recipients of the curriculum award for high academic achievement for the Division of Humanities and Education are Art Transfer, Animation, and Motion Graphics, Solomon C. Carrero. There are two awards for Art Transfer, Fine Arts Transfer. The first recipient is Mark Benito Allen. <clears throat> the sep second recipient is Melanie A. Porer. There are two recipients for Art Transfer, Graphic Design Transfer. The first recipient is Matthew Robert Seaman. The second recipient is Roxa Mean Soon. Deaf Studies, Human Services Option. The recipient is Jillian Carmel. Deaf Studies Interpret Option, the recipient is Curran Regina Town. <laughs> Liberal Art, Behavioral and Social Science, the recipient is Ariana Ronquino Shoves. For liberal art, math science option, the recipient is Anna Rose Flynn. The recipients of the Curriculum Award for Perseverance and Growth for the Division of Humanities and Education are Art Transfer, Animation and Motion Graphics, Aswani A. Howarth. For communication, the recipient is Daniel A. Griffin. Congratulations to all of the recipients. It is now my pleasure to introduce Dr. Kathleen Pearl, Dean of Behavioral and Social Sciences, who will present the Curriculum Awards for Division II. The recipients of the Curriculum Award for High Academic Achievement for the Division of Behavioral and Social Sciences is Criminal Justice, Criminal Justice Transfer, Alicia Marie de Haas. <laughs> Human Services, the recipient is Sarah Buckman. Paralegal Studies Jennifer, is the recipient is Jennifer Cambra. The recipients of the Curriculum Award for Perseverance and Growth for the Division of Behavioral and Social Sciences is Criminal Justice. The recipient is Paulina D. Vicente. Congratulations, 
Criminal Justice, Criminal Justice Transfer, Kim Marie Harrison. Gerontology, the recipient is Linnell Rebecca Dean. I don't know. Human Services, the recipients are Kalija S. Andrade. And the second recipient is Joshua D. Medeiros. Congratulations to all of the recipients. It's now my pleasure to present William Berardi, Dean of Business and Information Management, who will present the Curriculum Awards for Division Three. The recipients for the Curriculum Award for High Academic Achievement for Division of Business and Information Management, Business Administration, Kevin D. Medeiros. <laughs> Daniel John Rodriguez. Declan Neal Tabor. Samantha Whitney. Computer Information Systems, Computer Networking, Timothy Olford. Computer Information Systems, Computer Programming Option, Craig Dumont. There are two recipients for Computer Information Systems, Computer Science Transfer, Andrew Graham Briggs. Jillian Ames Massey. <laughs> Culinary Arts Baking and Pastry Option, Erica Dawn Romhild. <laughs> Abigail Lynn Swass. General Studies Mass Transfer, Jonathan Michael Beavis. Danielle Cabral. Aidan Paul Joseph Comerford. Amber Lynn Figueredo. General Studies, Health and Life Sciences, Kimberly A. Dos Santos. The recipients for the Curriculum Award for, for Perseverance and Growth for the Division of Business and Information Management Computer Information Systems, Computer Information Webmaster, Michaela S. Logan. <laughs> Culinary Arts, Baking and Pastry Option, Courtney Ann Kunha.
Cheyenne Taylor Pitsley. Amanda L. Sutherland. General Studies Mass Transfer, Brandon Rollins. Congratulations to all the recipients. I will now introduce Patricia Dent, Dean of Health Sciences, who will present the Curriculum Award for Division Four. The recipients of the Curriculum Award for High Academic Achievement for the Division of Health Sciences is from Clinical Laboratory Science, Brenda A. Ritchie. The recipient of the Curriculum Award for Perseverance and Growth for the Division of Health Sciences is also from Clinical Laboratory Science, Susan F. Ducharme. <laughs> Congratulations to the recipients. <laughs> Dr. Samad Saman, Dean of Mathematics, Science, and Engineering will present the Curriculum Awards for Division Five. The recipient of the Curriculum Award for High Academic Achievement for the Division of Mathematics, Science, and Engineering. Engineering Transfer, Engineering Science Transfer, Samuel Kelamu Lima. Life Sciences, Sustainable Agriculture, Elizabeth Mary Amaral. <laughs> the recipients of the Curriculum Award for Perseverance and Growth for the Division of Mathematics, Science, and Engineering are Engineering Technology, Architectural and Structural Engineering, Alejandro Risacco. Engineering Technology, Civil Technology, John A. McEver. <laughs> Congratulations to all the recipients. Now I'd like to introduce Dean Sarah Morrell, Dean of Division Six, Dean of Access and Transition. Thank you. Division Six, the Division of Access and Transition, is comprised of a number of college preparatory programs and programs of academic support for students enrolled at Bristol Community College. The College Readiness Award has been developed to recognize college-bound students who exemplify outstanding academic achievement and persistence, as well as long-standing and significant commitment to community service within our college preparatory programs. 
Many students were highly deserving. The recipients of the College Readiness Awards this year are Derek Belanti, I'm afraid I have to make Derek's excuses for him because he's at Derpy High School where they're also having an awards night at the same time. <laughs> Derek is graduating from BCC's Upward Bound program and will attend the University of Massachusetts at Amherst this fall. And the second recipient of the College Readiness Award is Anna Rosendiz Mora. Anna is completing the Gateway to College program this spring and also the English as a Second Language program and will be continuing her studies in an associate's degree program here at Bristol Community College. Congratulations to the recipients. It's my pleasure to introduce Dr. Greg Satharis, Vice President of Academic Affairs, who will present the Academic Achievement Awards. The Academic Achievement Awards are granted to those students graduating with an associate's degree who have earned a 4.0 grade point average as of May 1st, 2017. The recipients are Rachel Ann Aitkenhead. <laughs> Gloria Marie Alferis. <laughs> Alexandra S. Bork. <laughs> Richard Arthur Cabral III. Eric Borden Caffrey. <laughs> Stephanie Castellarin. <laughs> Ariana Branquino Chaves. <laughs> Joshua D. Clarkin. Anna Rose Flynn. Matthew Richard Hardung. Jillian Ames Massey. Sean Michael McGuire. Paula Francine Mountain. Timothy J. Oldford. <laughs> Janet L. Phelan. <laughs> Laurie D. Phillips. <laughs> Galen R. Riley. Andrew Seishu, Anne Marie Souza, Wayne Sylvia, Karen Regina Town. Joseph R. Travis. And Sue Winoker. Congratulations on this extraordinary accomplishment.
Students graduating summa cum laude are invited to apply for the honor of giving the valedictory address. From the finalists, two students are selected to represent their classmates based on their academic excellence in college and community achievements. They are designated as the valedictorian and the salutatorian of the class and lead the student processional at commencement. I am pleased to announce this year's salutatorian is Samuel Kelamu Lima. The valedictorian who will address her classmates at the commencement exercises on June 3rd, 2017 is Tracy Cooley. Dr. Suzanne Buglioni, Dean of the Division of the Lash Division of Teaching and Learning, will now present the Civic Engagement Awards. Ms. Erin Smith will assist Dr. Buglioni with the leader courts. Students who identify an unmet need in the community and design and lead a community service project aimed at addressing that need, earn the distinction of community service leaders. Our country needs those leaders more than ever. And so here are our leaders tonight. Daniel Thomas Borden. Kerry L. Branquino. Jasmine Marie DeBarros. Keith J. Dion. Kimberly A. Dos Santos. <laughs> Kathleen Gonsi. <laughs> Sabrina Elizabeth Jefferson. Michael R. Krawchuk. <laughs> Johanna Morales Madera. <laughs> Nicole Ann Tardanico. Roger Henry Tessier. <laughs> Chief Kamar Thakur. <laughs> Ashley J. Youngblood. The recipients of the President's Volunteer Service Award are Edwin A. Apaza, Christopher E. Azevedo.
Hanson E. Bargantine. Amy M. Blanchett. Jillian J. Braga. Samantha M. Coffey. Aiden Paul Joseph Cummerfun. Linda Carrera. Nicole M. Florio. Robin Monique Hardman. Jennifer L. Masala. Johanna Morales Madera. She's coming. Yeah, Johanna. Denise A. Musat. Valerie Maria Romano. Ooh, Romero, I'm so sorry. Ludmilla Maria Silva. Sif Kamura Takar. Paul R. Vermet II. The recipients of the President's Volunteer Service Award for student clubs and in organizations are the Dental Hygiene Club. The members are Amanda Cathera Bagana, <laughs> Ann Batello. Denise Kamara. <laughs> Melissa A. Cote. <laughs> Jessica Elaine DiCarlo. Jamie Marie Garrity. <laughs> Melanie Gennaro. Christina E. Kelly. Mallory Marie Ladoger. <laughs> Caitlin Hope Machado. Shannon Lynn Manning. Christine Rose McCarney. Alyssa Ann Moderos. Samantha Marie Mativier. 
Sydney Lee Aldroyd. Mary Victoria Liberty Race. Leslie Ashley Rendero. And Stephanie Adolfor Sylvester. The Science, Technology, Engineering, and Math, better known as the STEM Club, members are Sasha Alves, <laughs> Daniel Thomas Borden, <laughs> Christina Hendrika Brower. Finn Burback, Sarah Trinidad Hincapi, Christian Katumbe Kiambe. Samuel Kalamu Lima. <laughs> Timothy Lorenko. <laughs> Kylie Pasternak. Matthew Raposa, James Kelly Roberts, Richard Tavares, Shannon Thomas. And finally, the Bristol Community College Student Senate. Senators include Amy Marie Blanchett. <laughs> Luis Carlos Pereira Cabral. Ryan Thomas Kirby. Johanna Morales Madera. Travis Henry Willette. Daniel John Rodriguez. Valerie Marrera Romero. Oh, over that. One of the most prestigious volunteer service awards is the Newman Civic Fellows Award. This national award honors inspiring college students leaders who have demonstrated investment in finding solutions for challenges facing communities throughout the country. Through service, research, and advocacy, Newman Civic Fellows make the most of their college experiences to better understand themselves, the root causes of social issues, and the effective mechanisms for creating lasting change. 
I'm pleased to announce the winner of the Newman Civic Fellows Award, Daniel John Rodriguez. Congratulations and thank you to everyone for your hours of service and commitment to our communities. Our next speaker is Stephen Ozug, Vice President of Preparedness, Compliance, and Students, who will present the Bronze Shield, Silver Shield, and Scepter and Scroll Awards. Thank you. Thank you, Suzanne. The Bronze Shield Award is given to students who have provided continuous and outstanding service to a particular student club or organization here at the college. We have a number of recipients this year. The first one is for the Clinical Lab Science Club, Marissa Russell. <clears throat> for the International Club, Anna Resendiz Mora. <clears throat> For the Seeds of Sustainability Club, Elizabeth Mary Amaral. <clears throat> For Skills USA, Irene Mavridis. <clears throat> and Abigail Lynn Swass. <clears throat> For the STEM Club, James Kelly Roberts. <clears throat> and Nicholas Blair Rogers. <clears throat> and for women in STEM, Sarah Trindad Hincapi. The Bronze Shield Award recipients, congratulations to all of you. <clears throat> so going beyond contributions just to a particular club, the next award, the Silver Shield Award, is given to students who have made significant contributions to BCC, to the entire college, as they are recognized for rendering outstanding service of consistent high quality to the college. The first recipient, Johanna Elizabeth Boynton. <clears throat> Solomon C. Carrero. <clears throat> there are a lot of repeat customers going on here tonight. Samuel Kalamu Lima. Johanna Morales Madeira. <clears throat> Travis Henry Willette. <clears throat> Kylie Pasternak. and Valerie Mariah Romero. <clears throat> Ladies and gentlemen, our Silver Shield Award recipients, congratulations. <clears throat> and the last category is our Scepter and Scroll Award. It is the most prestigious of the college awards 
Membership in the Scepter and Scroll Society is given to students who have provided consistent and outstanding contributions of both leadership and service to Bristol Community College. The recipients are installed in perpetuity in the Scepter and Scroll Society, so many years from now their children and their grandchildren can come and see their names. This year's recipients are Ryan Thomas Kirby, <clears throat> Daniel John Rodriguez, <clears throat> Erica Dawn Romehild. and Siv Kumar Takur. <clears throat> Ladies and gentlemen, our Scepter and Scroll Society recipients. And congratulations to all the inductees. And now I would like to invite President Spraga back up to the podium to give out the Mace and Shield Award. The Mace and Shield Award, known as the President's Award, is presented each year to a graduate who has rendered the highest quality service to the college and who has demonstrated outstanding leadership. The name of each recipient is inscribed on a plaque which is located permanently at the college. This year's recipient, 2017, Amy Marie Blanchett. Congratulations, Amy, and thank you, President Sprager. My sincere thanks to all of the presenters this evening. Congratulations to all of the award recipients. Let's give them all another round of applause. Well, this concludes the awards presentation. Please join us in the Commonwealth College Center for a reception in your honor prepared by Jeff Caresimo and the students from the Culinary Arts Program. Thank you all for coming and showing your support, and have a wonderful evening.